Welcome back to another riveting video on the Psych 42 survey. Uh, Professor Wyman here with more tips in Google Forms. Um, so I'm going down to the demographics section and I'm just going to fill out the rest of this uh, the demographics section here. So the next question, and this is, it's not really demographics, it's it's demographics for students. We're going to ask about GPA. That was a variable that some of you were interested in. So we're going to add a new question and this is going to be short answer. And we're just going to ask, what is your current cumulative grade point average? I do want to make this, um, I'm going to add response validation. So again, I'm going to these three little dots right here, response validation. And I want it to be a number. So I'm just going to say is a number. Um, and actually I could make it more specific. I can make it between zero, which you should not come across and we'll put five. Um, and then we could add error text if we wanted to, but that's, that's not a big deal. So now I'm going to add my next question. And notice how it turns blue right on the side here because that's what we're working on. That's the question we're working on. Um, and then the next question, there were a few of you that wanted to, to learn about working hours and students. So how many hours per week do you work in addition to being a student? And then if you don't work, type a zero. So again, I want this to be short answers so that they can type in the answer, but I wanna make sure that they don't do something weird like write, 40 space hours because that messes with your data analysis. So we're going to go back to our little um, more options right here. And we're going to use response validation. And we're going to go to number. And let's, we're just going to say is a number. So I'm not going to, we'll just make sure that it's a number. And that's all we're, we're going to care about for that one. For the next question, we're going to ask about, um, there's there's a lot of different ways that we could learn about socioeconomic status. I, again, a number of you talked about this being something you'd be interested in learning about. Um, so we're going to do socioeconomic status, and we're going to have some different options here. But we're going to do it as a drop-down menu, just for fun. A little drop-down. And we're going to do first option. So how would you describe your current financial situation as a college student? Comfortable. Do moderate. Strained. I'm just copying and pasting from the document that we have in our shared folder that you have access to. And that's it. So that's our drop down menu. Now, of course, you should consider who you're going to be sending this to um, and be consistent with your question format. But I think using the drop down menu is it'll work here. So um, I'm not too worried about that. Let's go ahead and end the video here. So this is the end of our demographic section. Um, so we're going to go ahead and do stress is the next video. And that one will we'll show you the some tricks for um, copying so that you can be efficiently lazy like me.